So today I'm going to show you how to change the colour or hue of a specific part of an image on Photoshop CS5 and I've just got this picture here and I'm going to change the colour of these little white bits that are coming off the flower. So first you will start by zooming the picture and if you don't know how to do that you press Control Alt and then the plus symbol and you just get as close as you want it. So I'll go about that close and then you want to take this tool here it will be automatically set on this but you want to right click that button and choose the polygonal lasso tool I don't know if that's how you say it but yeah whatever and then you start selecting around the part you want to change so like you click it and then you release your mouse and then you do a straight line and once it's reached a point click again do another line click again now there are other ways of selecting, but I find that this one gives you more accurate selection. Even on round objects, it seems to be easier because it's really hard to draw straight with a mouse when you're just directly selecting it. So yeah, this one seems to work well for me, but you can really choose if you want to try something different. So yeah, you just select this whole little thing. And then you can see that there's a little circle that's come up beside the tool. And once you see that, you want to click it down. And you can see there's a little moving line around the part that you've selected. I'm sorry, I don't know the technical language. So now what you want to do when you see that is go up here and click Layer. Go to the New Adjustment Layer. And then go down to Hue slash Saturation. You can try all these ones. They do the same kind of thing. And then just press OK. I freaked out when this came out. I was like, what do I do? <laughs> but you just press OK. And you can choose what colour you want it. I'm going to, just because I've been just trying this, um, just go right to the end of the hue. So it turns it blue. And then end of saturation. Which turns it more blue. But you can like experiment and go like to all these different colours. But I'm just going to stick with that colour for now. Then you can put that back in if you want, I just don't so annoys me. And zoom back out by pressing Control Alt minus. And you've got one thing done. Now this is one that I prepared earlier. That sounds really lame. Um but yeah I've done a few on that. And I know it doesn't look realistic, but I just think it's kinda cool and it gives me something to do on my nights alone, which is every night because I have no friends in my social life. But yeah, so that's how to do that thing I just explained at the start on Photoshop. So yeah, thanks.